four what's up it's Rachel. welcome back to my channel my name is her if you're new here please be sure to subscribe and if you're not thank you for always coming back so today's video i'm basically going to recommend you guys hotels when you're coming to north cyprus i've gotten a few emails actually regarding this so i'm going to just recommend i tried okay first of all when i got these emails about hotels and stuff like that when i did try to do my research and i put in like hotel stay at north cyprus i went to this website and i tried to like check each and every hotel and the hotels there were like <coughs> they were like all these two-star hotels three-star hotels which you know there's nothing wrong with if that's kind of the vibe you're going for they usually have this more of a traditional type of vibe so if that's what you're going for like okay cool but like the websites literally put in as you can see these are the list of hotels that i found on like people's websites and stuff like that and on the website they literally give them ratings like 8.6 10 point whatever okay 10 is the highest what am i saying but like 9.5 9.7 and as you can see i had to like strike out some of them because i literally was like after putting together my data from all of these websites i decided to research each and every one like individually obviously i've not been to every hotel on there some i knew some i did not know so i needed to like you know and the hotels are just i'm sorry there are better hotels than this and why is this getting better ratings than other you know and i feel like if you're someone who has never been here and like try to search hotels to come to best hotels in cyprus or best blah 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 and you go into those websites and you see those races you're probably like oh my god that's amazing and you come and it's like well you probably think it's amazing because he is probably going to be like you know exotic a different kind of vibe a different kind of you know so like i said depending on what you're looking for but there are other like five star hotels that you come and be like oh, this is amazing you know so in no particular order i put together i think 10 or 12 i'm not really sure because <laughs> i just kept saying oh my god i need to put this in here i need to put this in here because some of these hotels are actually hotels i want to visit myself some i've gone to myself probably to spend the day because they probably have like activities and other things to enjoy within the hotels like kind of resort style ish anyways enough of this blabbing okay let's just get straight to it the first hotel i would recommend is lord's palace so lord's palace if you watch my vlog i went to lord's palace once and spent literally the whole day there by that beach but i'm going to insert pictures and videos so lord's palace is a five star hotel and on google it has a 4.5 rating out of like 2600 people so that's that's a good rating you know 2600 and it averaged up to 4.6 that's good in its own sense the lord's palace is located in kyrenia it offers rooms that provides all the amenities for a comfortable lifestyle with the view of the surrounding mediterranean the Beshparmak mountains and kyrenia's favorite entertainment street bella marine lord's palace stands out in comfort and style among cyprus hotels so they have standard room suites connecting suites lord and lady suites so they also have like a spa you can get massages sauna all of those good stuff they have pools outdoor pools so they have their own private beach they also have like private meeting rooms if you needed to have that you can have like a reception kind of venue you don't even know me like that are you past my time put you on my mind come a little closer like that staying up all night throwing drinks by
this is what Lord's Palace looks like. The second hotel I would recommend is the Merit Royal Premium Hotel Casino and Spa. So I actually found this hotel also on a on a website and they gave it a 9.5 based on whatever calculation they did. Whatever it is, this is something I agree with. It is a five-star hotel. The ratings on married hotel on like several websites is like almost 10. On bookings.com is 8.8 .8 out of 10. 345 people. But basically the ratings are very good. It is also a five-star hotel and it is massive. And this is somewhere I aspire to go and spend the night at least. I've not been there to sleep there, but it's beautiful. Okay, it's, it's just, you know, it's situated by one of the most beautiful coves in the Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus Zyphorus Cove stretching towards the clear waters of the Eastern Mediterranean Merit Royal Hotel Casino and Spa is 10 kilometers from Gurna city center and 45 kilometers from Erjan Airport. So the Merit Hotel itself consists of two blocks. All rooms in the main block have balconies and views of the sea or pool. There are a total of 125 deluxe rooms, namely 16 king suites, 36 suites, 90 standard rooms and two royal suites. There are 14 junior suites and 6 king suites in the royal premium block. All rooms are equipped with smart room automation. In each one, there is central air conditioning and LCD TV, a mini bar, a safety deposit box, a phone, a blow dryer, a bathroom with a top, a tea and coffee pot, and wireless internet connection and these that i just mentioned are all inclusive in your hotel bills these people know how to sell themselves okay okay so they have all of those things in addition they also have like a playroom or whatever for like kids they also have like indoor pools outdoor pools they have like a buffet service they have like restaurants they have you can get massages you can most of these hotels that I mentioned actually have almost have all of these facilities because they are mostly like all five-star hotels The next hotel I will be recommending is the Grand Pasha Hotel and Spa. So it is a five star hotel as well and on Google it has a 4.2 rating. Like this hotel has like an indoor pool, a double rooftop bar, you know, all those good stuff, Wi-Fi and all these things. Like I mentioned, I don't want to like repeat every detail, but almost every detail I've mentioned for the previous hotels, they all have, they're all five star hotels. You just make your decision based on what it looks like and all that stuff. And I'm going to put in the video so you guys can see. It's a very good location. They're all like very good locations. They're in Guinea, you're very close to everywhere. It's like, yeah.
next hotel i'll be recommending is the life hotel so life hotel is a four star hotel it is not as bougie as the first five i believe five that i mentioned but it's cute and it's decent with a decent pay and it's cute you know it's not extra but it's good it's a place i can i can stay i can stay at you know and you also get free breakfast with your accommodation so that's a plus plus i mean the breakfast is not the variety is not as much because i've stayed in life at life host <laughs> Because I've stayed at Life Hotel, the variety is not as much as the rest of the hotels I've mentioned. But they do give you like free breakfast with like variety. But if you don't want that, you can just easily like walk out. And there are restaurants literally like next to the hotel, around the hotel, five minutes walk. There's just so many available restaurants around you. Life Hotel has a 3.4 rating on Google. I mean it's good it's not a bad hotel i've been there so take my word for it it's not a bad hotel it's just not as fancy as the rest that i've mentioned so the next hotel i would be recommending is craters it's a five-star hotel and has a 4.6 rating on google and this is more than 3,000 people rating it and it has a bath somewhere i want to go to i mean i've been there severally for like their buffet and stuff like that because they have several restaurants and they have like mad buffet but what i really want to go for is their maldives they have this maldives type ish room where your rooms are literally like cabins above water i want to go there <laughs> i've called them severally i'm sure they're tired of me i like keep asking about the price like it's gonna change it's the same every time regardless i keep calling like it's gonna change it's not sis it's either you have the money or you don't have the money damn The next hotel I recommend you all is the Pia Bella Hotel. It's a four star hotel. It has a 4.2 rating. It's a four star hotel, but it really doesn't look like it. It looks five star. So, according to this, Pia Bella Hotel is not in city center, but it's just a brief walk from the historic harbor with its wide range of shops, bars, and restaurants. It has over 170 guest rooms. Furnished, fully furnished with all mod cons. Basically, it has free parking, it has a pool, it has casino and gambling that I know it for. <laughs> Airport transportation, which is amazing. It has free internet, free breakfast, evening entertainment, and meeting rooms. One thing I need to add, you don't smoke indoors. Isn't that like a universal rule? You don't smoke indoors anywhere. Let me know. Anyways, because of its location, it's not by the beach, you're not overlooking the sea, but the view is mad though, and it's really pretty, It's and it offers you good, you know, facilities, so. So the next hotel I would recommend is Colony Hotel. So Colony Hotel is actually just 
by city center it is a five-star hotel and it has a 4.3 rating on google which i don't know why because i always see it like an elite hotel i've just never walked into it it gives me hilton vibes let's just stop there so architecturally it has the architectural blend of the colonial style of the island's past with a glory and ottoman era the hotel is a haven of tranquility and opulence amidst the bustle of the busy town and harbour i agree but the archon colony is just proud of its reputation for stylish elegance and comfort in its surroundings and attention to detail and customer care elegance part like that's why it's like it's giving me like hilton vibes like it has free parking free high internet speed pool fitness center gym workout room it has a bar casino and gambling airport transportation i always feel like airport transportation is a plus if you don't come and start paying for taxis because they kind of overcharge if you know and you don't know what's up so they have conference facilities wi-fi a rooftop pool outdoor pool Pool with a view okay restaurant breakfast buffet i always love that poolside bar rooftop bar meeting room spa massage rooftop terrace sun terrace okay guys calm down concierge dry cleaning laundry service i believe they have like dry cleaning in pretty much every hotel and a concierge you know just saying the next hotel i would be recommending is kaya palazzo is kind of new kind of ish it was the place i went for my birthday that was my second time going there i had never ever been into the hotel building itself from the outside it seems amazing and it has a massive pool with like an amazing view and it gives you beach vibes and stuff like that it has a 4.6 rating on Google, but just like 693 have rated, so keep that in mind. Acapulco this is definitely a resort it's not even very close to city but it's worth the journey and staying there and if you're going to drive there it's probably going to be like 20 minutes drive it's not that deep nowhere is that far in Cyprus it is a five-star hotel of course it has a 4.3 rating I've been to Acapulco like twice for the water slides it is definitely a place you can come with your family a whole family kids have something to do you have something to do your husband has something to do your boyfriend your girlfriend your i don't know everyone has something to do you know
so dome hotel has a 4.1 rating on on google it is literally by the beach by the sea in city center i feel like it's one of the it has a great location let's just say that you can literally just stroll to the harbor from dome if i had to guess i would have been like that's a five star hotel i'm surprised it's not they even have smoking rooms nice i guess if you smoke and definitely ocean views you literally come out the balcony and your balcony is hanging just above the ocean which is cool make sure you guys give me a thumbs up because it helps me out on youtube and it also lets me know that you guys are enjoying the content make sure you subscribe when you do subscribe make sure you hit the bell right next to subscribe because it lets you know whenever i do upload a new video and i'll see you guys in my next video bye if you feel like there's someone who would benefit from this video share it please thank you come follow me to a secret place where only the moon can see beyond the shore